we're at the cave and that's the little slough you can see there's the bar right there but there's something swimming right there looks like a bunch of porpoises inside the bar oh, breaking out of the water too. see them there feeding there's another one yeah I, I know there's two or three in there they're hunting pods anyway they're chasing something around see see they got their nose out of the water they're herding it up now <laughs> day it's the crack of dawn no waves in sight there's the cave just to the east a little bit it's a nice day I like it stand by we got the little 16 schools on today for that iron there's a real guru it's bleak here. We have to have to make a move. See what the real guru's doing. I got a penny and a nickel and a big copper conductor of some kind. I got four quarters. Four quarters. Shit, you on a Klondike. Bobby said he's going to he's going to Easter our spot. Oh, that is a nice one. Yeah, look at that yellow in that thing. It's in there with a penny. Ooh, I was hoping to find one, but I haven't found one yet today. Yeah, I got I got four quarters in, in close. Same you know, place where I was yesterday. I mean, if you can see these rocks or not, I probably can see them green ones. This is the area that had all that sand pumped on it. Remember them truckloads and truckloads of sand? Well, the last three or four little blows have uncovered all the rocks again. It's like a lunar landscape here. What the hell do you think this is? Big. I pull that out of the side of it, whatever that is. Stand by. Well, I crack it open. I got that thing inside of it. Not much else in there. That wire doodad thing is still there. I don't know what the hell this thing is. Let's take it home with us and crack it open when we get home. I see uh, Bobby Whitfield. He said he was coming up this way. He's got a cousin coming to town. He's a bar one. I ain't got an extra one. I'll give it to you today. Uh, whatever. As long as I get it by Wednesday. No, next week, I mean. Nine inch stealth. 920 IX. Big scoop. I let him borrow it for a couple weeks, see how he loves it. He does. <laughs> Another damn what's it? You see that copper thing sticking out right there? It sounded good. I thought it was a rock. I dumped my scoop out, couldn't find it. I went over this and whatever it is is inside of it. For later observation. Looks pretty good right here. I just got here on this side. A nice little cut right there. Don't go very far. But there's a nice cut and a lot of rocks. Stand by, I got a hit. Nine seventeen. Whatever the hell nine. Well, well, we got us a bracelet. Looks like probably stainless. Could be platinum bracelet. You know what I mean. Stand by. All I can see it says www. 
energy-armor.com. Oh, but now I see stainless right there. Bobby's hollering. I said, "Come over here." Got two rings. He said, "Junk." Junk. Well, about like that bracelet I found. Oh uh, yeah, a different size, ain't they? Yeah. And they hook together. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's pretty tricky. Oh, hold on. Ring man's been in these rocks for two hours. One spot. You see how he's making out here. You can see the rocks now. The water's got a little clearer. They're everywhere. I need the rocket nader. You ain't kidding. You need a rocket nader today. Bobby found two rings that hooked together. Bobby found two rings? Hooked together. You know, like in a circle. Oh, oh okay. They look like platinum. I mean, uh, titanium. Or It's hard to tell what they were. Yeah. How you making that? You got any taquitos? No. I got a stainless steel bracelet. That's all I got. Well, we're getting ready for the roundup. Been toting that stuff for a long time today. Gray matter, batteries. God. I got Brutus back from my Bobby. There's a lot of difference in them scoops. Look at this. <laughs> Look at the damn size of that thing. Ooh, that's a nice scoop though. Light. Don't be taken away by the size. Don't be scared. It's a nice scoop. Nice, big, moves a lot of sand. You get the newer one with the fancy back with the slits in the back of it. Save all that little stuff if you like it. That's a hell of a scoop. Stand by for a roundup. We got well, we only got we got two watches from the other day, and we got three watches today. But this one's got the eraser on it, so we don't have to crack that one. We, we just got two to crack from the day and two to crack from yesterday or the day before. So stand by. Let's uh, get them cracked and see what's in them while we're still outside. Well, the littlest one didn't have nothing in it. The biggest one had this, look like copper wire doodad running through the middle of it. The little piece with the brass rounded in, whatever it was, and I hit it, it all come apart. But it looks like brass or copper or something. I don't know. And then... The other one had some kind of little junk metal in it. And then the last one, that bigger piece had this copper looking thing. And it, I ain't going any further with the hell with it. It just looks like copper junk. Okay, what's it? Done. A lot of targets today, a lot of digging, a lot of crap. Two nickels, a little bit of gray matter, two more batteries. Then they don't find any batteries. I find batteries. That's damn odd. Some kind of big old insulator. I presume that's what that is. This is the best of it. <laughs> Pencil eraser. You saw the bracelet and that fantastic stud. Okay, I guess we'll, uh, I don't know where we're going to go tomorrow. Ringman's got some school stuff. If he can't go in the morning for low tide. So I think we're going on our first evening spin tomorrow from, it's like 7 p.m. to 10 or so, the land of Nala. Stand by for that. Good luck to everybody.